we were on the approach road to the Deepin's caravan site. So it's up here somewhere. I'm sure it is. Anyway, in a rush in. Be up on the left somewhere. I don't think it's much further. The area looks nice. We just driven to an Aldi's. No, we drove to a little, which was about eight mile away, which was a bit of a jaunt. Uh, but honestly, some of the area looked beautiful. Some of the houses and stuff. The town is very picturesque, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. Here's a caravan site coming up on the left, in between all these beautiful fields. And we need to remember the, uh, the code. Yeah. Okay. In a quarter of a mile, turn left. She's still telling me. I thought I turned her off. There's a bit, bit of a bump there. There, I might Take have the to next left, then turn right. Good grief. I might have to sample a beer in a minute in the clubhouse. There it is. And it's all gated here. I've got the code in to get in. Just run into the post. Turn right, then slide left. Mm, Hopefully that's the right one. I like Laura and Hardy on the left. Yeah. yeah. Outside the clubhouse. Mm. On it, aren't we? I have no idea. There we go. I just had a little of a play with the gate because uh, you're supposed to put enter and it just had an E next to the enter and they didn't notice so uh, and it looks like loads of people are in the clubhouse. Uh, there's a little play area for Slide the Slide left then now. your destination will be on the left. Don't you just love people that won't shut up. Take the next right then mm, sharp shut right. Up. Oh, should I? Yeah, it's only five mile an hour around here and we're lucky we just go around the corner out and our pitch is there we're on 36 what was it 36 i 36 i which it's, is just there on the right it's very spacious yeah the way everything's laid out and the palm trees to my left your right destination there. is on the right oh my good god There we go, we're back on. And that concludes this evening's uh, mm. drive to the Deepins. There's our pitch. So we're just going for a walk around the caravan. There's the uh, current bun. And I'll show you when we get down the bottom of the view from there. We've just walked down from up there that was where our pitch is by the facilities block and over there again and a bit of a view over there surrounded by fields aren't yeah it's surrounded by fields everywhere so, and then you've got that coming down again it's beautiful sunset there and then that's the other side of the side down there and round to the other side of the pitch over there in the corner where the trees that's the dog walk so where the little bear it's not too much but the little bear likes it like that so he doesn't want to do too much of a walk 
there's a couple of these water points dotted around this one here and then there's the other one that's just up the top of there if you can see it it's just at the top by the green hut you can see it just in front of the green hut or maybe you can't there's the other water point by the pods and you've got the uh, the ranch behind I'll walk down and show you a bit of that it's not open no I don't know where it's open tonight it may be these are the pods they're really nice to be honest there's a few of them yeah there's the ranch and these beautiful palm trees and there's, you, I don't know if anybody's in there, so you can't go and see really. But they're really nice. It's a tidy little site. And they all seem to be working, doing something. There's a quite a big team of like maintenance. We shall go and have a look in there one of the nights. Who's that handsome chap in the re reflection? <laughs> yeah, here's the basketball come football court. So, and it goes down to the uh, crazy golf. The crazy golf. So, I have to get a ball. Me and my wife play football. That might need a rest after that. So, if we go down here, look. Oh look, there's a dinosaur, quick run. And there's, oh, tractor. Little play area, I presume, for the kids. And the little crazy golf. Oh, and chess. And you can sit out of the back of the club there, look. Which is really nice. Oh look, is that a raptor? I've, seen, I've watched uh, what you call it as well. There's one behind you. <laughs> yeah, I was coming out there. This is the back end of the pods. So, and you've got the, the ranch, the sports bar and the toilet block, which is back down to ours. And there's that beautiful sunset, if I can get it. Oh, you can, yeah. Yeah, you can see it setting again. Get some beautiful sunsets there. Here's the facilities block. Go and have a quick mooch. It's cleaned regularly. So you've got to decide then. So go in there. A little seat. A seat there and everything. Very nice. Then out to a nice speck. Then you've got the mother and Baby changing room, or should I say parents and changing room, mm. and that's good. And look, I think this is a good little touch, got a little bath, so, and you got your hair dryer and hand dryer, and the men's toilet. You've got your own little like, little washroom there, so I might need that one, I need to shave, and there's your showers. And you've got a seating area, so yeah, you've got oops, that's our crap. One, two, three. And you've got your urinals and your three toilets. Which you probably don't want to look in the toilets, but they are it's all done to a nice spec. And you, mirrors. And I keep asking, there isn't a note here, but apparently Joe said they ask you to keep turning the lights off, which is good to keep saving you. Yeah. Here's the laundrette and they've got one wash machine and a tumble dryer and a sink i don't know how much it is it doesn't say it's usually about these places are usually between two and four pound aren't they a wash that's the laundrette where we just came from and this is the clubhouse got a nice seating area outside and it's open tonight they were only opening it now, now the kids have gone back to school. Uh, Thursday, Friday, Saturday and Sunday. Oh, and there's a playing area here for the children. Looks like Pat's car. There's 
There's reception where you have to go when you book in. There's gates in and out. And they're coded to give you the code. Here's the club guys from a different angle. Don't recognise them two young men there. And there it is. That's where all the tour touring sites are down there. And then they've got the, the residential over there. And we're just going to go and try and walk through to find the lakes. This is a fishing lake we found on the uh, residential area. We'll go and have a look around. It's not very big, but honestly, some of them fish I've already seen because I just popped in before I started the video. Some of those fish that have, uh, and it, they're massive. Be nice and quiet sitting here all afternoon. There's a resident model coming back for a I'm looking around. Some of them fish were huge. It'd be lovely yeah, fishing it. Well, I don't fish no more, but if you do, it, you, I reckon you'd have a great time there. Nice few benches so you can put your sandwiches on. Yeah, yeah. Sit back well, and relax. You can't do what I used to do where you put your beer in the water. <laughs> the actual cans, you'll lose them, you know, yeah. 575. One and two, twelve. There we go. Well, that's a tour of that's the site. Um, we have noticed there's a few people on the touring path that seem to uh, be living here permanently, which I wouldn't blame them, it looks really nice. <laughs> so, but overall, it's a nice site. And the uh, people that, that are living here, they're really friendly and helpful. They'll stop and chat to you. Yeah, yeah. The, the one man took us for a trip. He, it, we went the wrong way to get to that lake earlier, yeah. and he come all the way around us for a walk just to show us where the lake was, <laughs> uh, which was really nice.